The year was 2008. Greg Nichols was mayor. Up and coming Fleet Foxes were signing with Sub Pop. The sculpture park was barely a year old. Jeff Bezos was only worth $8.2 billion. And the Supersonics were packing up for Oklahoma. Enter onto the scene. In 2008, Art Zone was a brave Seattle Channel dive into the creative arts pool. As part of the broadcast mission to cover the arts, innovative folks at the city station approached King TV's Almost Live and City of Go-Go's Nancy Guppy to be a video DJ for their on-air programming. The plan was she'd stand in front of a studio wall of TV cables and sandbags and encourage people to tune in to upcoming shows. Okay, but Nancy had another idea. Hi there, I'm Nancy Guppy and welcome to the premiere episode of Art Zone in Studio. This is a weekly 30 minute show devoted to the local art scene. 2008 was a humble beginning. Don't we need light? Hi and welcome to the Okay, over here we've got some really cool $376 built to show a studio set of recycled materials. This, my friends, is the piece de resistance. This is Art Zone was filmed on Tuesday. It aired on Thursday. And the whole thing had to be taken down and stored every day to make way for other Seattle Channel shows. Check it out. But by December of that very first year, Seattle had watched 30 new profiles of artists. It competes with advertising, and that's something that's really important because it symbolizes democracy in public space. The best result I get is when I don't think about so much. All right, cool. There were countless interviews. I tried to do set up punchline, I swear. <laughs> Many more mistakes. This is in school? Well, I was learning this in school to just focus on the music and trust my fingers. Come on, people. They turn the spotlight on art venues. Here we are in the fabulous On The Boards lobby. Cheers. Cheers. This is where really cool stuff happens. Like what? They experimented with in-studio performance. I swim no more. Weekly ways to get your attention. <laughs> with a thousand reminders to get off the couch and out into the arts. It was obvious. Come on. There was no turning back. Over the next 10 years, the Seattle Channel, Nancy and the AZ crew constantly changed up the show to fit the needs of a creative community. Hi, nice Hi. to be here. I love that voice. <laughs> Including moving out of the studio. Stay tuned for Art Zone coming to you from the place where the music matters, KEXP. And into a different venue every week. From the Northwest African American Museum. Below Dell Reserve. From the riderly paradise that is Hugo House. I felt this sort of empty narcissism in a way. Like, we did the show and then everybody claps for us. They dug deeper into the lives of artists. In the center of it, you guys are like this thing that everybody's trying to get a piece of. They created new events. We staged three one-hour talk shows in front of a live audience on the second floor of King Street Station. This is sort of like some sort of marriage council. It is. <laughs> All they have to do while they're here is be a writer. And documented unsung heroes. There is a kind of safety in terms of the way that you're cared for there. And as usual, she demands that I do the dances that the kids are doing now. There's been a decade of perfecting the live music performance. Artists were given a safe place to vent. Trust me, as a fat, queer, mixed-race, Latinx, non-binary person who identified as female for most of my life, I've heard all of your edgy, original jokes before. Kind of feel like the world is breaking, a crash of the place, now the earth is quaking. Now, too cold Art Zone the introduced new kids now, in the block. Too bold, never do what I'm told, I'm a move on my own. Psycho, psycho, dance on my own. Yes. While saying goodbye to others.
<laughs> AZ with Nancy Guppy. Hello, hello. Hit it, is alive and well. Action! We put together and in his 11th year of obsessive dedication to artists, audiences, and the cultural life of our city. So when you're in front of the painting, you get a sense of him working and reworking. Look at that double A that's crossed out. I felt wood was a medium which was clearly male-dominated medium, and I wanted to bring women's voice in that medium. It's a story for people of color. It's a story for Asian people. It's, it's, it's me. By the time I decided I wanted to design vacuum tube guitar amplifiers, it was a technology that was no longer being taught. As soon as I want the poem, I just look and I mine for it. I think there's an element of masochism that goes into each piece. We become light and delight some. And maybe even a little bridge, bridge with someone in the orchestra. Oh, that's awesome. You know, dance saved my life. It gave me a path. It directed me in a way that I've been able to experience all of these amazing things. To celebrate the first decade, they've unearthed a few clips from the past. Hard as I can. Okay, but don't. Oh! <laughs> There's the blood, the sweat. The tears. No, okay, just forget it. And the bologna. The only thing crazier than making a sandwich like this, Nancy, would be eating, eating it. it. You gotta take the whole plate, I'm okay, cramping. Uh, yeah. okay. oh, you're cr the vault will be opening no, this fall. So, okay, so keep an eye out. High five. High five. More moments to come.